self-doubt, lack of confidence in oneself and one's abilities. It's a horrible thing you don't doubt yourself when you doubt yourself because it's like if you don't believe in you, who will? You know what I'm saying? Like who will believe that you could do it if you don't even think you can do it? Welcome back to my channel, The Beauty Shaman. Thank you guys so much for coming back. Um, today has been kind of a blah, kind of a blah day. Um, sorry if you guys hear like sounds or things like that. Joanna's working in the background. I just wanted to come on here and talk about self-doubt. What, what I'm thinking in my head. Self-doubt has killed a lot of things for me personally and not thinking that you're good enough or not thinking that what you want to do is capable because of who you are or, or what you've been through or where you're at in life and I don't know I just have I've come to find out that that's not true that everything happens for a reason Everything happens for a reason and we are all put on this earth to do something. Like people who shine, they didn't get there overnight. Like they weren't born knowing, oh, I have a super ability and I'm going to just do it. And no, it's like they work to get to where they are. It's that type of thinking that I really have to get out of. Like I'm not good enough to do something because it's not true. Um, I have a brain. I'm capable of learning. If... I understand what it is that I'm doing then I can do it self-doubt is a is an emotion is a is an emotion that I want to just get rid of um, I don't want any more self-doubt I don't want to think that I can't do something or I'm not capable of doing something because that's just negativity really stopping you and you're not going to know if you're able to do something or if you're capable of doing something until you actually do it it's all gonna play out I just feel like in my journey right now, in, in self-discovery and figuring out who I am as an individual, I want to learn how to get the feeling of self-doubt out of my train of thought, out of my thought process. Because the moment I start self-doubting myself or thinking that I can't do what it is that I want to do, that's when I go into my modes where I don't want to start something, where I feel like I can't start something because this this not the other where i'm waiting for the perfect time because this this that and the other like it doesn't work like that i feel like sometimes they can take a step back especially when it comes to like viewing things on social media and um youtube and things like that i look at other people and i'm just like well wow you guys are doing great you guys are, are awesome too bad i can't ever be like that too bad i can't ever be in a position that they're in oh too bad i can't you know do this this and the other and it's just like it's not true it's not true I don't know I just feel I'm just ready I'm just, just ready to like get out all the negativity that I have inside in other news you everybody's first comeback is oh a stripper stripper uh, being a stripper is not a fucking comeback okay it's a fucking job whether or not it's looked at as a good job or a bad job just like being a fucking janitor it's still a fucking job it is what it is to validate a woman's life on a job she held or is holding come on come on get it together get it together what you do to make money. So Catfish is coming back. How many of you guys like to watch the show Catfish? I'm, I was never Catfish. Because I don't play those games online. When I was young, I talked to you. You know, on the internet, if I personally knew you. If I didn't, I didn't really, you know talk to you yeah I don't know a part of me is like can, is this real do people actually operate like this in the world like are people really getting catfished but then I guess they are not, not everybody is the same not everybody thinks the same so just be careful 
I will be watching Catfish. Let me know down in the comment section below if you guys watch that show and what are your thoughts about the people on the show? Like, some of these stories be like, you guys remember the episode where the girl found out it was her best friend catfishing her? Her best friend. Y'all know say. Anyway, so going back to self doubt. You just gotta know who you are as a person and know you also have something to bring to the table. You also have something to offer as an individual in this world. You don't have to feel like what you say is not good enough or what you say is not going to be heard or you can never do what it is that you see other people doing. If you want to do it, figure out how to do it and do it. I mean, no, it's not going to be that simple, but there is a way. You just have to be willing to find a way to do it. Like this hair, bro. Like this fucking hair, bro. I really think I'm about to freak out. Like, I just want to have faith in myself, like, 100%. Not that I don't have faith in myself, but I want to continuously believe in myself. I want to remember each and every day why... I get up and do the things that I do like what is my purpose what are my goals what are my dreams what is it that I said I wanted to do am I closer to it am I doing anything to lead me to that goal like what am I doing sometimes I feel like I'm not doing much and I'm not good enough I'll never be good enough so what's the point? I'm too weird, I'm too loud, I'm too obnoxious, I'm too playful. Like there's a whole bunch of things that goes into my head. And my dogs hate me, that's why they're playing in the background like that. Wanna really focus on trying to get all the negativity out of my head, like out, because... Because... Because your mind is a powerful thing. If you are not controlling it, it will control you. And I want to find a way to tell myself the moments I do get low, the moments I start to self-doubt, like it's going to be okay. You're not you're not less. You're not less of a person. You're not any less smarter just because you didn't accomplish what this person accomplished or you didn't do what this person did or it has done yet. Now the battery is fucking dying. Are you kidding me? I'm never gonna win. So let me just say what I have to say. Because the fucking memory card is filled, now the fucking battery's gonna die. Don't let anybody tell you that you can't do something or it's too late for you to do something or you're too young or you're too old or you're not this person or blah blah blah. Don't let anybody tell you that because life is what you make it, to be very honest. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I hope this video was entertaining. I hope it made sense. I hope there was actually a video out. My next video will be Friday. I don't know if I will be uploading a video every Wednesday. I'm just going to be honest with you guys. I don't know. I don't know. Like this video if you thought it was helpful, good. Um, subscribe. Subscribe if you want to be my friend in real life, then you better subscribe to me if you want to be my friend in real life. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you all in my next video. Let's hurry up and record this damn thing before it decides to shut off again. Ugh.